common meditation mistakes for busy people, potentially causing individuals to abandon the practice altogether. Are you making these typical meditation mistakes that hinder your progress? It's a question many of us have pondered as we sit in silence, struggling to find that elusive inner peace. Meditation, with its promise of calm and clarity, can sometimes feel like an uphill battle. You're not alone if you've ever sat cross-legged and thought, why isn't this working anymore? Perhaps you've tried to incorporate meditation into your daily routine, but it's not unfolding the way you envisioned. Or maybe you feel like you've hit a plateau, and your progress has come to an unexpected halt. It's easy to fall into these patterns and lose sight of your meditation goals, but fear not, for this video is here to help. We will explore these common pitfalls and share tips on how to meditate in a sustainable way that allows you to delve deeper into your practice. So stay tuned as we delve into the reasons why your meditation might not be working as effectively as it could be. The first and most common mistake is the lack of consistency in practice. Consistency is the key to unlocking the transformative potential of meditation. It's not about how long you sit or how well you can fold your legs. It's about showing up day in and day out. Consistency allows for mental and emotional transformation, taking you deeper into the practice with each session. So how do you cultivate this consistency? Start by making meditation your first task of the day, before breakfast even. Start with two minutes per day if you must, but pledge to yourself that you won't miss a day regardless of circumstances. Busy day ahead, wake up a bit earlier, traveling or sharing a room. Find a quiet corner in a park or even in the bathroom. Doubtful about the right posture? Do it anyway and read about it later. Remember, it's better to meditate for 10 minutes every day than half an hour three times a week. If you're enjoying the content and want to stay in the loop for more exciting videos, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Subscribing ensures you never miss out on the latest tips, tricks, and adventures. The second common mistake is having too high expectations too soon. It's perfectly natural to start meditating with the hope of reaping its numerous benefits. However, once the habit is established, it's essential to let go of these expectations. Instead, learn to enjoy the practice for its own sake, much like you enjoy everyday activities like eating, sleeping, or taking a shower. Begin to appreciate the aftermath of your meditation sessions. Revel in the calm, clarity, and centeredness that follows. Of course, it may not always feel blissful, but as you stick with it, you'll realize that on average it feels quite good. Remember, the deeper benefits of meditation don't come overnight. They require months, sometimes even years, of consistent practice. So it's crucial to hold your expectations lightly so you can sustain the practice for the long haul. After all, meditation is a journey, not a destination. Enjoy the ride. The third common mistake is frequently switching from one technique to another. Now, in the early stages of your meditation journey, experimenting with different methods is not only acceptable, but encouraged. Variety spices up your practice, allowing you to discover what resonates with you and what doesn't. But here's the catch. Once you've dipped your toes into different meditation waters, it's crucial to settle on a technique that suits you best. Think of it as a musical instrument. You don't become a virtuoso by sporadically playing the piano one day, the violin the next, and then the guitar. Mastery comes from consistent practice of one instrument. Similarly, different meditation techniques can yield different results, and it's crucial to find the one that aligns with your unique needs and goals. Once you've found your meditation instrument, dedicate your time and energy to it. Find a technique that resonates with you and stick with it. What are your other challenges when you try to meditate? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. So, are you making these common meditation mistakes? Let's recap what we've discussed in this video. First, we talked about the importance of consistency. Remember, meditation is a daily practice. It's not about how long you sit or how well you can fold your legs. It's about making a commitment to yourself to meditate every single day. Whether it's in the morning before breakfast or in a park during your travels, consistency is key. Next, we explored expectations. It's natural to anticipate the benefits of meditation, but it's crucial to let go of these expectations and enjoy the practice for its own sake. The benefits will come with time, so be patient and enjoy the journey. Lastly, we delved into the issue of technique hopping. While it's important to find a technique that works best for you, constantly changing techniques can hinder your progress. Choose a technique and stick with it. 
Now that you know these common mistakes and how to avoid them, it's time to enhance your meditation practice. Happy meditating. In our upcoming videos, we'll discuss more ways to transform your lives. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out.